Good morning. I'm going to show you some things I got at Steinmark. Um, as I said before, um, like this year, this year again is going to be a small Halloween haul. Um, last, you know, smaller than last year, and partly because, well, I'm spending ninety dollars a month for internet, which I'm only using to get angry at a couple of video games. But that's because the PlayStation 4 needs Wi-Fi. If it didn't need Wi-Fi, I wouldn't have to spend the $90 on that. I could be spending my money on stuff to share with you guys. But that happens. So, and the other reason also is because of the situation we find ourselves in right now. The Associated Steinmark told me that they would, yes, normally have Halloween coming in. Uh, again, they wouldn't always know what they were getting because it depends on the truck. But now that's it's even more so because they're behind a couple of months. And the cashier told me that they're still getting in sleeveless t-shirts. So basically, Steinmark, like other stores, are delayed in everything. So I will keep checking back. I talked to the associate and he suggested I keep checking back to see every, you know, every week. I can't do it every week. I get paid every two weeks. So every two weeks, I will try to go back and hit Steinmart. I already know At Home has their stuff. So Steinmart, I'll hit every couple weeks to see if their stuff is in yet. Ross, of course, that's another one we've been going to. Marshall's has some stuff. I believe that's where we got the adorable no face trick or treater last year. So we'll see. Stanmart has wonderful bedding. I want to get another set of sheets. So I want to keep checking with them to see their sheets and their towels because I have hand hand towels. Oh. Yeah, I have hand towels. The pick pick your poison. That one's faded because I've used it quite a bit and the sugar skull is getting a little dingy because I've had to wash it with other stuff. So I digress. So basically that's what's going on due to the situation at hand everywhere. Steinmart is not regaling us with Halloween early like usual and the other stores probably won't be as well but like I said I will keep checking. Um, but I did get a couple of things because I wanted to share something with you. Okay this is not Halloween but Wicked. We have we have Wicked Mix. And this is Smoky Hot Chipotle. It has a Chex Mix. mix. It's got um, cashews, almonds, peanuts, pecans, and other tasty morsels. Flavored with seven wicked spices and chipotle pepper. So before we go into what else is in there, let's see what this tastes like. You know me with hot peppers. And once again, we need to pause so I get a pair of scissors. And we're back, just like that. Okay. And it's resealable. And now we're getting a visitor. She smells food. No, you can't have these. These are hot and spicy. We'll try whatever this is. I think it's the sesame cracker. And a pretzel. It's kind of buttery tasting, but I'm not really, the chipotle is not hitting me. I'm not sure what this is. It's like a Rice Krispie. That had a little bit more spice. Here's a peanut. Spicy sweet. It's 
Not bad. Yeah. And it's by a company called, well, it says Moonlight Mix is Wicked Mix. And they're from Little Rock, Arkansas. I will try to remember to put the link down in the uh, description box so you can see if you can get some. Steinmark apparently is a bit like Marshall's. They have their own things that they sell, but it changes as well. I went back to get... It wasn't legal hemp. I misspoke. It's legal as in it is legal, but the brand name is not legal hemp. It's hemp plus. I went back and checked to see if they had the shampoo and conditioner, which they don't because, again, I guess like Steinmart and Burks, they have some outlet stuff as well where they get it in and then they don't have it again. I will put this bag somewhere to keep make sure the cat doesn't play with it. And you sense the theme with my Halloween stuff with my basic witch. It, I would never use that as a latte cup because it's the size of a soup bowl for me. And then I've got the travel mug that says, which better have my coffee? Well, I have another mug. It's a nice cauldron shape. And it says, basic witch. And I can't see the name of the brand on the bottom. It's, yeah, basically they are like um, Marshall's, TJ Maxx, and Burke's because there's a was price on here. It was $12. Steinmar has for $7.99, and I can't see the name brand because it's covered. Let me see if I can peel it off. Because if I can find the name of the brand, maybe, just maybe, somebody savvy can order it online and get more. Or maybe me. Like I said, somebody savvy or me. I'm not, I do not claim to be savvy. www. I think it's BWTT. Creative ideas for home entertaining. So I think it is BWTT. I will check it again. I'll get my reading glasses out and I will check it again. I got a little bit of grease on there, unfortunately, from those snacks. And I was going to do this by itself, but I tend to. This I did not get stuff. I think I got Walmart when I went grocery shopping. After I went to Santa. Ta da! Krakatoa Hot Chips also has a hot, hot honey pot. And this one is spicy honey and scorpion chili. Its um, intensity is two on here. 6,360 Scoville units per chip. Timing slow build with a lasting bite. Location tongue and throat is a smooth burn. And again, these are cattle and potato chips. And I'm going to save this. This when I do get a kitchen, I'm going to have this one and the Zap Voodoo Heat, and probably the regular Zap Voodoo, along with my I, my jalapeno, Jose's Jose's hot sauce and some other scary kitchen stuff. Taste the spicy honey. I mean, it is a slow build. Mm -hmm. Here it comes. Yeah. My tongue feels a little tingly, and my back of my throat feels warm. a little bit. Mm. Mm. 
Not bad. A little bit of a burn. It is spicy honey up front, and then the scorpion chili slowly does sneak up on you. It's got the spice plus the heat, which is I like. Um, if it's heat, all heat and no spice, it's not worth it. So again, Krakatoa hot chips, this, the hot hot honey pot, and also the sour king, which had lime. I highly recommend both of those if you like spicy food. Okay, update on my orders. I paid the invoice. To Stephanie Whitley. She's going to be starting crocheting the bat. It'll take her about a week. So that's taken care of. So the, the order is official now and it will be coming within a week or so. Mm. Give or take, considering the mail is going to be slow. Also on the Vampire Freaks front, I left the crack o click o for <laughs> Click 04 shoes in my cart too long. Um, the size I need is sold out and the shoes went on clearance. The only size they have left is a 10. I was going to get a 9 to allow for the fact that Demonius seemed to run a little narrow. So we won't be getting the Click 04s. I am instead getting Flappy Bat and uh, I'm the bunny. I think his name is Bun Bun. The a black version of the pink resin one I showed you on here when I got a Fairy Bones resin haul from a thrift store. So instead of Floppy Bat and a pair of shoes, I'm getting Floppy Bat and Bun Bun. They're on the way. And because I need shoes, I went to Hot Topic Online. That's not the name of this, it's Hot Topic. The, you know, their online store because that's the only place they still actually have goth per se as opposed to just pop culture which is typically what they are, a pop culture store. So I'm, I'm getting a pair of skull sneakers, canvas, another pair of low canvas sneakers, these are overall skull print, and a Annie roll, which I had never heard of. I'm getting the cat, it's a, roll, a large roll, Annie roll kitten kitten um flush so basically i will have on, on my bed then i will have the forward thoughts sad puppy and then the annie roll large cat as pillow rolls which reminds me eventually i need to get a regular pillow again i need a new pillow i've been pushing that one for a while now washing it and washing it and the stuffing you know how it does it starts to clump up and it's lumpy so i need a new pillow anyway the large bonus that one of my coworkers said we were supposed to be getting this check, I honestly didn't see it because my check was just a little higher than normal, but nothing spectacular. So it was not a fat check. I pretty much did what I normally do: take care of business and do a little bit of a little bit of fun shopping. The little bit of fun shopping being the two items I got from Steinmark. The shoes are only $16 plus shipping, if I recall. Plus, the pillow was more, close to 30 bucks. And you, for, you, uh, you can round up your total by a dollar to help, basically, music therapy uh, by the, uh, run by the Hot Topic Foundation. So. We're getting, you know, we're donating money to HotTopic.com for their music therapy program. So there's that too. But the actual things I'm getting are the sneakers and the pillow roll. I think that's it. Mhm. Mm yeah. The vampire freaks, two stuffed animals, Hot Topic a parachute. The parachutes, eight one of these shoes I want, but eight pair of shoes, and another plus. So we're getting. Three plushies, a pair of shoes, and my Onmagurumi bat. Those are all on the way. I do want to order some bizarre teas from Victorian Trading Company, but that's again going to have to wait. So that's it for now. Um, where are we at? 
I can't read it. 15 minutes probably. Yeah, 15 minutes. So we'll wrap this up. So again, my re review of Wicked Mix. It's spicy and spicy and sweet. More sweet than spicy. Just a little bit of a kick. The ch it, Chipotle is not that strong, but that's okay. If you, do, if you like spicy, but you don't want it to slap you in the face, this is a good recommend. And... I'm not sure what the link is on this. Again, I'm going to get my reading glasses out. I think it's BWTT. I will read that. I will add the link for this, the website, and I will add the link for that, and I will re-add the link for Krakatoa at the bottom as well. So on that note, I will let you go. I am going to end this video right now. Uh, add the links and this brief description. Upload it, and you will see this later today. I'm on my way to motor vehicles again to hopefully take care of the paperwork for the car. I love you guys. Keep it dark. Keep it weird. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell for more of this nonsense. I love you guys. Bye.